the Jets' territory. Rippon's going to air it out downfield. One-on-one -on -one coverage, and this one is caught. And backing into the end zone is Jerry Judy with his first touchdown catch in his rookie season. Wow. Just took it away from Pierre Desir. And the Broncos jump on top. Well, Pierre Desir is in perfect position. He should have intercepted it initially. I thought Jerry Judy was, was playing defense. Desir has given up some big plays. He got benched week one. And Greg Williams is not going to be pleased about this at all. You see where Desir is in position to make the interception. And he got mossed right there, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry Judy, the rookie. Nobody really likes it. Some just throw it better than others. And I know Brady doesn't like it either. Here's one. Caught by Judy to the 21. Rippon was at 75% completion rate prior to that 14-yarder. There's Jerry Judy. We saw him make the big play on the outside, but they move him around. They put him in the slot now, and he comes off the ball. He runs a good route. He's able to get a step. They just get it away on second and eight. Rippon has Judy, but overthrows him. Touchdown. It's second of the game, and now you've got Desir making up for that touchdown throw that Judy grabbed over the top. Two picks, a touchdown, and this is a two-point game. I think you can credit Basham for this interception. You know, the way that he's able to come off that edge and, and get to Rippon, I don't think Rippon had a, had a clean view on this because there, there just wasn't anything there. I mean, obviously, there's three helmets, three green helmets out there and just nothing. And really, right from the beginning, I mean, the read would not take him there. And I, I think Basham getting there and the other pressure that he felt, he just didn't get a good view of it.